Zelda game of fish flingers, you want to be at Catherby, where the fruit tree patch is, and you want to be in World 89, first of all. Make sure you're in World 89, and you want to join the French chat to fling fish. All one word, like that. And so you join it, and you just wait, and pretty much just sit here, and talk to the fisherman, and you'll see opens in four minutes so in four minutes we'll be allowed in the lobby and we can start jotting down some clues where to fish so I'll be right back in four minutes and show you what to do next also useful things to have is a tackle box you can have any tackle box I think I know there's a beginners tackle box or something then it goes basic I'm just going this just in case I want to go for a trim comp one day so I actually have the tackle box have a tackle box so if you're fishing somewhere else like you know the time like and that's another thing if you want to get maximum XP an hour like you can bring a games necklace and go to Barbarian Outpost and bring feathers in your inventory alright as you can see we are starting to get calls in the French chat which means you can go in there and so if you're fishing somewhere else and you start seeing calls in the French chat that's when you want to start heading over and yeah so when you're in there I'll just pop up a notepad like this and this is pretty much what, in, what you want to do. You see trout, and I'm just going to be jotting about, jotting down all the clues. So trout, it's beach, so you write beach. Uh, and it's 3 to 4 weight. So you pretty much just want to jot down all the clues they give us. See pike. You get pike at the river, so you want to write down river. And a large hook will be used to catch it. That's why it says large. It's pretty straightforward. And we got another clue for herring. It's at beach and DBL, which means double. So that's a double hook. Like you'll just learn these on the way you go, you know, you can ask what does double mean and that is pretty straightforward, so it's not that hard. Anyway, bass, shellfish, you know, oh, I think shellfish could be either like oh, lobster or whatever, crayfish or shrimp. So I'll just write shellfish until someone makes it clear and you catch them at the docks. And docks is at the start place, I'll show you where each place is as well. And what have we got here? Um, pretty much just look through and um, hit trout, beach, cricket, so beach and cricket and trout is done and what you want to do like say at the docks you don't have a combination which is the first place you want to go to head to the one that you have the full combination to and fish there till you find another combination and fish there so like you're not wasting time you're still getting XP and all that alright and that will compile hints at the end before it starts so you want to write them down and make sure so I'll just resume once I the game's just about to start alright it's about to start and I'm just going to quickly go through where each location is before I actually go fishing <coughs> and well yeah my fixed screen's a bit stuffed up I'm just doing on fix so you can see more clearly what I do and as you can see so it's just blocking the screen it's a massive thing I'll just hide that for now yeah that's better this is the docks where everyone goes, it's pretty obvious the docks, you know, where boats go on the dock. North of the docks up here is the lake. See, this is the lake here. Got a few fishing spots. And also you can fish wherever, just cast the line. I'll just show you, you after. And down here, the bottom part, is the river. And if you go north of the river, just keep following along the path, you will see the beach. And just north here, see there's someone fishing at the beach there. So... I'm going to see if I have a beach location since I'm here. Yes, herring is at the beach. See, we've got herring there. Beach, so it's at the beach. All right, G moth, so that's green moth. And double hook one to two, so it will be green moth, double hook, and just go through, just hover over, and you see double hook, and wait one to two, so it's either one of those. So you want to test that with trial and error. And, of course, if being resizable, and also, see, make sure your rating's 100%. For example, if I just try two first of all, you'll still be like 83 or something. Yes, 83, so that means it's not right. You need to try to catch six, all six fish a game at 100% to get a challenge. And yeah, you get a medal for that. And also, you want to assist fish as well. So if you see someone catching a big fish, you want to assist them. There's three medals you can get at the end of the game. Um, I'll just, I think there's bubbles here. Someone just said they hooked a big fish. Um, not not here. Anyway, there's three metals um, at the end of the game you can get, or metals, however you call it. See, there's a big fish there, so assist them, and you are now assisting, you earn one big fish. Uh, I don't think I got it in time, but yes, there we go. See, one out of six big fish. You must get six of those a game. And I will move on to the next one. See, we know the location 
oh we also know beach the trout is also at the beach and that is cricket slim 34 it someone gave me double and someone gave me slim so um i'm just going to i just left one of them there just in case it's one or the other not sure anyway 83 so it must be three weight take three and let's see if we get a hundred percent that's hundred percent and so I know I've caught them I pretty much just put a few lines like this there and make this bigger so it stays there and you want to look in the French chat and bass I'm gonna to go to the docks next and that's cray 5 STD and STD is not what you think it's standard it stands for so you want to put where's crayfish crayfish standard hook which is the first one and five so three and a two is five and I'm just gonna go not many people fish in this dock here that is a dock as well but most people go to the west one no one's really here now they probably went there at the start but I just went as a demonstration it's best to say the docks at the start though just saying and I will just catch one of these quickly yep hundred percent so I'll just put a few dashes there and what what are we looking for pike also just keep looking in here look for stuff all right cod um river wormwood too sorry if i'm saying this fast but like it's a fast game you need to write things down really quickly in that um so worm wood hook and two just make sure at the start of the game you don't have to jot things down but it just really helps just make sure you get at least one combination so you just get maximum as you can see 100% just comes at the top cod 100% I'll help him with his big fishy what do we got yep three out of uh, six big fish I think yes big fish and what was that I just caught something at the river cod eh? yes um, bass I'm gonna look for bass now it should be uh, written in here bass I've done bass bass is um, that one so I don't think uh, I've got salmon to do. I accidentally cross that off, so I'm going to look for salmon. Um, just keep looking through the French chat. See, salmon is at lake, and it's a locust bone six. So bone hook, all weights on for six, and it's a locust. There we go. And the lake is up here. You'll get used to lo the locations pretty soon. It's um, yeah, it's pretty straightforward after a while. And also, for a better chance to get big fish, stand on your own square. Don't stand on other people's square because it's, yeah, there's a chance someone under you will get the big fish as well. So, yeah, there's a less chance. Anyway, I'll just assist this bloke and just cross off what I just got then. And I just got salmon. So I'll cross salmon off. So all I need now is pike and I'm done. And, oh, of course see pike and you want to fish the heaviest fish once you've got them all and see someone in the French chat just said pike heavy and cod heaviest and you can check this by going on ratings and you'll see here heaviest cod and you'll see the weight and once you catch all six fish all six species you want to fish the heaviest for the rest of the game so yeah that's pretty much what you do and I'll just go quickly get the last one pike here it's at the river and it's shrimp large and four so shrimp um, large and four. Where's the large hook? There's a large hook, and I'll just fish here. And that's my last fish. Once I get it, yes, I got it. And there we go. So that's one out of the three metals done. In the game medals. I don't know why I'm saying metal. It's not damn metal. It's a metal way. Eh? Anyway, I'll just help assist all fish so um I can get my six assists a game. So that's the two out of three medals that I expect to get every game and yep that's all you really need. See six out of six big fish so that's two medals so for the rest of the game you pretty much want to just camp at the um, best thing you can and I think cod was the heaviest yes it was the heaviest and cod is at the river where we are and it's wormwood two so you just want to put worm wood and two and pretty much just sit here like that and see someone's under me quite a few people so I'm just going to move to my own spot so I've got a pretty decent chance to get all three big fish in the game just make sure you're always getting 100% rating so just that's one thing to make sure you get more points a game than that so I'll resume when this game is ending alright also now you see I've hooked a big fish but no one's assisting it so 
you can pretty much clear the line if you want to get rid of it and just put on what you had before just memorize what you've done see I let the big fish go and there's like one and a half minutes left I probably would not catch another big fish in that time to get my medal so I'm just gonna let it go and keep catching and see zero percent um, once you've depleted this um, river source um, you just want to go and um, head to the second heaviest which I think was pike at the time I don't know what it was um, but I'm just going to fish something here at the beach because everyone's heading there and I'll show you what to do after like there's you got an option you can either you get kicked out of the game and you can just walk out of a portal I'll show you and you can just sit at Catherby and catch shark or whatever while you're waiting for the next game or you can go to Barbarian Outpost and fish some fishies for better XP so there we go game ended pretty bad points here on 18,539 XP gained that um time and so that's alright I usually get around 19k and you can't get really much more than 19k you just want to go through the exit portal pretty much there we go I've gone to the exit portal so you can either catch shark here or fish there or you can go to the barbarian outpost this fishing spots around 70k XP now and like I think there's about a 10 minute rest in between games I'll just check time yes 10 minutes rest in between games so you can get about 10k XP while you're here so that is, and you can do three of the like so a game goes for 10 minutes and you got 10 minutes of waiting time so that's 20 minutes around which means you can do three of those an hour obviously and you get around 20k XP for fish fingers and third and 10k here so that's 30k times 3 so you get around 90k to 100k XP an hour just doing it this way see and this is what a tackle box comes in handy I can't find the fishing fellow that just tells you what's going on and when the time is so if you don't have a tackle box and don't want to waste money on it just look at the time and when it's you know five minutes later you want to start heading back there and just wait for the wait to get in the lobby and also you can just wait for people to start calling out in there so I'm just going to end the guide here pretty much alright hope this helped and hope you enjoy 90k fishing XP now doing this it's um it's a pretty complicated guide I remember watching a guide for the first time and the bloke was speaking like heaps too fast and it was just confusing as I just like I'm never going to do fish fling so I just got one of my mates to uh, walk me through it and it made sense so you know just after a game or two of practice you'll get the hang of it it's it's hard for me to explain things as the game's pretty long like 10 minutes of explaining and that so but anyway so hope you enjoyed this and it helped i uh, hope you see it fish flingers so see you later and please subscribe if you enjoyed